Sixers and the Pistons being swept, we know that the Celtics are playing the Bucks. Yep. Um, and I guess we could field uh, predictions here. Um, uh, look, Bucks and six, man. Bucks and six. Yeah. I'm um, I'm gonna go Bucks and seven. Okay. But um, I originally was gonna go Bucks and seven. But I but originally I was this the one of these two teams in my mind were going to the finals. Mm. So I picked the Bucks to go to the finals, but yeah. I, I said if they weren't going, the Cel I think the Celtics were going. Mm -hmm. I think the Celtics were going to. I think the Celtics are going to take it up a notch, and okay. you know that 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 was my um, right. right my my uh, my synopsis on why I thought the Celtics might mm -hmm. go if the Bucks didn't. Right. Um, um, I, I think Kyrie versus Greek Freak, obviously, they're not going to be guarding each other. Right. But I, I think that's going to be a show. Yes, it is. Yep. Um, I don't think Kyrie Irving, with that team around him, is going to allow the Bucks to just walk all over him. And let's be clear. Mm -hmm. um, when you look, at, or let, in my opinion, when you look at, you know, obviously, Greek Freak is miles beyond Kyrie Irving. Yep. And but and when you so you look at those two stars and yep. you look at the rest of the roster, the Celtics got the better roster. I um, I, 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 would, I would I would slightly agree with that. The Celtics um, got the better roster. I, I would slightly agree with that. Um, I do not. However, I I don't think that it's I don't think the gap is wide as maybe somebody else might perceive it to be. Because let's be clear, the Bucks offense is. It's popping right now. They're well coached, though. Yeah, they are well coached. And then that's not to say the Celtics aren't. That's said. That's to say that um, they are well coached. This team was offensively challenged the year before. Oh, uh, the Bucks. The Bucks. Yeah, yeah. No and question. New coach comes in. Coach came in, and now they're not offensively challenged. Yeah, but either way, the offense is popping. <laughs> whether it's the coach, whether it's the yeah. players, whether it's the system. The so offense now, is popping. So the, and this is always my my theory, and in, in particularly in playoff basketball. Yeah. Yeah. Obviously, the coaches put you in a position, but the Bucks will be in position if this is to be an upset. Mm -hmm. And I'm not picking that upset, but if this is to be an upset, mm -hmm. it's going to be because of people like Al Horford and Jason Tatum. Mm -hmm. If Jason Tatum decided to get in his bag, who who beside? They, they gonna have to go like well above what they've done in the regular season for them to pull the upset off. One hundred percent. Yeah. But you have seen Jason Tatum in the playoffs. Yeah. And, Jason, he's, and he's played well. And Jason Tatum ain't no slouch. And he's played in the well. Playoffs. You seen Al Horford in the playoffs in the past, in prior years. Yeah. He's played well. No. You seen Jalen Brown. Brown in the playoffs in, in in just last year. Just last year. Yeah. Like we we've seen these mm -hmm. players. Um, I like Eric Bledsoe. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, I, I like um, Middleton. Uh, Middleton. I like uh, Ily Ilya Sova and um, and, and Miritich and, like, coming off the bench could knock down threes. None of them people. None of those players outside of Middleton and Bledsoe, mm -hmm. and not even so much Bledsoe. But I give him his credit because he's nice. They don't scare me like Horford, Tatum. <laughs> and, and let's, we ain't even talking about Gordon Hayward. And, 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 and let's be clear, um, the Celtics have good coaching too. Yeah. There's a system there as well. I think you're looking at two but you're coaches looking at, going at it, two systems. But, but I think you, and let's be clear, uh, Budenholz is a better coach than Brad Stevens. I'll say that because he's just he's just been here. Experience. You know yeah, he's, yep. I, I, I'll give this slight edge to the Bucks. Did it with a team without a superstar. Yeah, and yeah, and, <laughs> and, and, and in some respects, um, was doing is. And actually, I kind of take it back because Brad Stevens did it last year without his superstar. About two yeah. of his stars. I'm just, I'm, all <laughs> for that I'm, matter. All I'm saying is. So actually. So all, all I'm and all I'm saying and you can you come to my point. All I'm saying is mm -hmm. is that the playoffs is always in my mind mm -hmm. about superstars. Now yep. I'm not saying Greek Freak isn't better than Gordon Hayward and Kyrie Irving. He's right. Better. Mm -hmm. Is he better than both of them put together? Is the Greek Freak better than? Yeah. I thank God for the haters.